All right, so we're here with Matt Finnegan. We're at uh, unit number four at Mid-American in Council Bluffs. Matt, tell us why this is arguably one of the, considered one of the most efficient power plants in the country. Uh, I think Walter Scott, unit number four, both from a heat rate perspective, so from a thermal efficiency perspective, and from the pollution control equipment that we have on the back end of our unit, we have one of the cleanest facilities in the U.S. in terms of emissions. Post-combustion control, okay, the, the combustion's already occurred, you've already created the steam, it's already gone through the turbine, you know, already created electricity. Before it goes out the stack, you have an opportunity there to reduce emissions further with all these uh, air quality control equipment. 30 years ago, how much of this would have been here? You'd virtually have none. You wouldn't, you wouldn't necessarily have a scrubber unit, um, so no capacity to, to remove SO2. Uh, SCR, probably not. Low NOx burners, probably not. So your capacity to eliminate NOx is not near what it is on this unit. Um, you wouldn't have a bag house, which eliminate, helps eliminate SO2 and, and opacity for that matter. And you wouldn't have activated carbon injection for mercury control. So as far as the technology goes, it's advanced quite a bit in the last 20 years. What you have on Unit 4 is it's probably the cleanest plant in the nation or at the very top of the nation in terms of controlling all four of those, opacity, uh, NOx, SO2, and mercury control. Mid-American Unit 4, widely considered one of the cleanest plants in North America. Technology in action, and those are the facts.